everyone and welcome to the first Discover God of this virtual camp. Before we start, let me pray. Heavenly Father, please will you guide us through this Bible study and help us to learn more about you. Please use it to change us and teach us to be more like you. Amen. This morning we're going to be looking at Luke chapter 15, starting at verse 1. So I'm going to read for us if you'd like to grab your Bibles and follow along as I read verses 1 and 2. Now the tax collectors and sinners were all gathering around to hear Jesus. But the Pharisees and the teachers of the law muttered, This man welcomes sinners and eats with them. Now we've read our passage, we're going to answer some questions about it. So, pause the video, grab a pen and paper and scribble down your answers to these questions. Who is listening to Jesus and what do they say about him? The Pharisees and the teachers of the law are with Jesus. They are shocked that he is with sinners. They think they are better than everyone else, so Jesus tells them a parable. Open your Bibles and we'll find out what this parable is. Starting from verse 3, follow along as I read. Then Jesus told them this parable. Suppose one of you has a hundred sheep and loses one of them. Doesn't he leave the ninety-nine in the open country and go after the lost sheep until he finds it. And when he finds it, he joyfully puts it on his shoulders and goes home. Then he calls his friends and neighbours and says, Rejoice with me, I have found my lost sheep. I've got some more questions for you guys so we can dig deeper into this passage. So, grab your pen and paper and pause the video while you scribble down the answers to these questions. How many sheep does he have? How many sheep does he count one day? And what does he do about it? From these verses, we can see that he has a hundred sheep, but one day he counts there are only 99. So he leaves the 99 sheep and goes and finds the lost sheep. I want you guys to try and find the main point of this passage now. So you're going to pause your videos, read verse 7 and scribble down on your paper what verse 7 says the main point of this passage is. The main point is that God wants everyone to turn back to him. How amazing is that? Over this camp we hope that you guys will learn how much God loves you and you'll also learn some tips to share with others that he wants them to turn back to him. We've reached the end of today's passage and the end of our first Discover God together. Let me pray as we finish. Lord Jesus, thank you that you love us all so much. Please help us to share with those around us that you want them to turn back to you. Amen. We hope this has been a great start to your day. Don't forget to tune in to the main event later and we'll see you tomorrow for Discover God again.